Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will cover uh, what is JDBC data source. Uh, as you know already, using uh, driver manager we can get the connection. Like that, using uh, data source object also we can uh, get the connection. And uh, getting connection using uh, data source object is a preferred way. And uh, data source object represents a factory for connections to the physical uh, data source. Okay. And uh, usually how we will use uh, data source object is uh, when uh, uh, web server or application uh, starts that time uh, we will register the data source in the naming service okay as a key value pair uh, here you can see tomcat or jboss server when it starts uh, we are registering uh, dpcp2 related uh, data source in the naming service okay and uh, from web application using uh, jnda lookup we can get this uh, data source and uh, from that data source we can uh, get the connection and uh, use it in the web application okay uh, the interface uh, data source is available inside the java.sql package uh, this uh, data source interface is implemented by the uh, driver vendor uh, like uh, mysql driver vendor or oracle driver vendor etc okay and uh, there are three types of implementations the first one is uh, basic implementation uh, which produce the standard connection uh, it is uh, equal on to uh, getting connection from the driver manager okay and the second one is uh, connection pooling implementation which produces the connection object and uh, that will automatically participate in the connection pooling okay and uh, this kind of implementation works in the uh, middle tier connection pooling manager okay uh, the third one is uh, distributed transaction implementation which produces a connection object uh, that may be used for uh, distributed transaction and always uh, it will participate in the connection pooling and uh, this kind of implementation works with uh, middle tier transaction manager and uh, also it will work with uh, connection pooling manager okay uh, the data sources uh, two main methods uh, the first one is uh, get connection and the second one is uh, get connection with uh, parameters username and password and uh, once you get the data source object uh, by calling this uh, get connection method we can get the connection object okay and uh, this is about uh, jdbc data source and uh, thanks for watching bye